Hello, and welcome back to Caves of Cud. Well, we're here at Great Gate. So, Matthew, what you what you got? What you got for me? Anything cool? Plate armor, carbide plate armor. That's not bad. Um, we don't need a recoiler, which is nice. Uh, oh. The one time, the one time I would love it if they had, like, a longsword. And generally speaking, um, carbide folding hammers, I don't know. They're, uh, hard to come by. <laughs> so, I, um, that's, that's just, like, bad luck. Let me see here. Is there anything else? I mean, a pickaxe. Let's buy the pickaxe. I could probably stand to sell some stuff. Uh, what? Engraved cloth robe and laser turret disguise. When did I get this? What? What? I just... I... I just hit the jackpot. This... This disguise gives plus 500 reputation with robots. Oh my god, when did I get this? This is incredible. That is like one of the most valuable <laughs> engraved cloth robes I've ever had. My god. Oh, that's really, really good. That has made my day. Um, yeah, goddamn. Holy crap. I'm, 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 I'm super stoked for that. I think that would actually put me in favorable. Let me just see control F. I'm gonna go sc scroll down. Um, can I do page down? Yeah, there we go. Robots. Ah, uh, yes. 500 reputation would in fact put me in like non-threatening. Oh my God. Yo. I'm very excited about that. All right, we do have to get ourselves out of Great Gate though. It may be, it may be tough, but we're going to do it. Um, now I can try and start. Oh, we leveled up. Uh, oh, I do really like light manipulation. Wings is good. Y'all know I love my wings. You know, wings is great because you can just like cheese Golgotha. It's like, yeah, that's like the best reason to have wings. I think I want to take light manipulation because that means we don't actually need a ranged weapon and light manipulation always lands let's take light manipulation we're level 10 uh, we only have the one point right now I don't think I'm going to rely on light manipulation is it ego base? I guess it is so that means it's going to be, um, it's going to get better as time goes on, no matter what happens, which is really quite good. Um, so we don't need to even look at bows and rifles anymore. I don't suspect, well, I mean, uh, you know, like we're probably going to want a gun anyway. Um, chances are good. Light manipulation will just serve as my torch for now. Uh, improved dueling stance. Your, your two hit bonus in dueling stance is increased to plus three. Yeah, I mean, let's let's take that. I'm gonna go hard on uh, long bl blades. Um, let's take tinkering and disassemble. Um, could take tinker one. I think I'd rather have customs and folklore for now. I just like to cover my bases, you know. Um, we're going to be able to get Trash Divining. I'd like to get Trash Divining before we go to Golgotha. Um, and that way we can actually get the most out of the trash in the base of Golgotha. Um, bad stuff is happening right now. But we got that really nice penetration from uh, the dueling stance. So, you know, it's not all bad. Oh god, we have a slug. Slug, slug snout. Um... I think we can take a slug snout. We're, we're doing all right. We're doing a bit better. 
Though the Electra Fugue scares me a little bit, I won't lie. Can we shield slam them? Oof. Well, at least that's the best they can hope for now. Uh, we're getting a little bit close to death here. All right, let's. Let, why take? Why take chances? Let's take a uh, witchwood bark. There we go. Um, we got some mirthworm corpses. We're okay. Oh god, another electro. Oh no, that's not an electrofuge. That's just a tick. Okay. I'm I'm enjoying long blades. I will say I, I've generally generally speaking I've never been able to figure out long blades, but you know I, I think having spent enough time with Caves of Cud and gotten comfortable with some of its denser, um, is that another slug snout? Yes, it is. Uh, it's denser mechanics. I I think I finally understand the value of the long blade. The nice thing about the long blade is it um it definitely helps you get more bits i remember i think it was gavin it might have been gavin a uh, friend of the channel gavin in the comments had told me that if you use long blade and swipe with dueling stance then you can disarm robots for some extra bits all right so this is our first floor done we are famished that is quite the debuff we've been hanging around with Onwards and upwards, as they say. I don't like how many doors we have going on. We do have, um, you know what? Let's, let's, oh, we can't wear this, can we? Wow. My, uh, my day is ruined. Genuinely. That's the coolest, it's the coolest clothing I have ever had, and I can't wear it because I have carapace. Wow. Well, uh, we are being frozen. Pius Templar is making a mess of things, as they do. I'm gonna swipe them. Maybe not. Okay, that's that's that. Um, let's smack. The, the electro oh there's another electrofuge okay that's a little scary if we could like um hold on you know what let me let me put lays a little bit higher um okay i want to make sure that dueling stance is at least with the other stances shield slam is fine where it is um, I don't expect I'll ever use precognition and vision. Uh, mark target. I guess I don't think mark target works with lays. But I think this will be better. Uh, we don't have to toggle on or off. I, I don't need to have that. Okay. Cool. And, and now we have lays. Let's see if we can lays an electrofuge. This might kill us. Let, let's take some witchwood bark. There we go. Oh, right. Uh, okay, we are swinging in the right direction. There we go. Uh, that was a little bit spicy, but we're, we're okay. Uh, there's still something over there. Is that a carbide long blade? I'm gonna grab that real quick. Carbide long sword. Oh, that slug snout is really tearing me up. Okay, I managed to put some distance between me and them, and this door was exactly enough to uh, to help me. Let me let me put that carbide longsword in my hand. Um, I'm not actually. I'm not sure if it's it would be better. Two-handed long iron longsword. What um, what's the deal with two-handed? Increased penetration on critical hit. I think it's still. I think it's better. I think the the two-handed long iron sword is still better. 
Let me just have a look. I'm struggling right now. No, it's this is still better. Okay, let's let's go ahead and equip this. Um, let me just double check. Yeah, one uh one d eight versus Oh, actually the iron longsword was it was as it was as good damage, but um it wasn't as good penetration. And that definitely makes that better. Uh so do I, I guess this looks now died to the wage droid. I think the wage droid probably saved my life. I'm glad we just got disassembling so I don't have to deal with this. This is a lot of bits we just got. My goodness. Um Whoa! Oh, can we see that again? Oh, I want to see that in like HD High resolution check this out <laughs> Mr. Stark, I don't feel so good that animation is so good. Oh my god. I love it We got a stun rod I'm gonna treat those to scrap very soon Why did I get knocked towards them? I didn't mean to do that. Okay swipe um shield slam is now seven they uh there's been an update an upgrade to the way that um key configs work um when you get a new ability it automatically assigns it a key and this is really really good i am a huge fan of this change okay we're disassembling uh stun rods i can't believe we can't wear that frock it's like the, I don't take I don't I don't I don't like I don't get carapace very often so the fact that it's like my undoing in the most brutal way really sucks I'm gonna go ahead and start a precognition here and we're just gonna go to town on these lads I'm more concerned about the uh, centipede And now the crab. The crab is a problem as well. Is there another crab? Okay, the centipede is dead. The crab is going to be a problem. We don't get stun... Uh, we can't stun lock. Oh god. I need to recover. Um, kind of don't like the way this is going, so I am actually going to go to the be beginning of my precognition. So we're going to back up. Who says precognition isn't still useful while you're playing roleplay, you know? Like, the thing about it is, is it really just lets you get an idea of how a combat's going to go, and then... You know, play it slightly differently. How did he get behind me like that? That was impressive. Okay, we're at full health now. Oh, wow. That was actually really well-timed. Um, kill that centipede. Centipede is dead. Blaze the crab. Um, but it did not pen the crab. Mirthworm is fighting the crab. I'm cool with this. Swiped. Mirthworm is dead. We're all good. We gooch. Um, well, this isn't very gooch. Okay, now it's totally gooch. Two copper nuggets, I'll take it. Okay, we have a weird artifact, which is a thermal grenade. Love, love me a uh, thermal grenade. Um, steel longsword, we could take that. I don't know why we would, but I'll, I'm going to take it. I'm going to treat these chrome revolvers as scrap. And disassemble it. Oh, God. Oh, what a horrible place to be. I keep finding myself in awful, awful positions. I'm going to go ahead and sprint. So we're not in, like, that gruesome position. All right, Mirthworm is dead. I want to 
put some damage in on this crab. I really don't want to take the electrofugues smack. I really, I mean, even the tick is not seeming like a good idea right now. Oh God. This could, this could be really bad. Okay, Tick is dead. That's uh, kind of a weight off my mind. All right, Crab is dead. That's actually amazing. Um, I think I can maybe take a blow from the Electrofuge, but uh, just, uh, you know, oh, we slipped on the slime. Okay. All right, bring it. Bring it, Electrofugue. Okay, we, we, he brought it. Oh, thank God. Okay, things are really spicy right now. The Grit Gate, uh, Grit Gate is displaying a, um, you know, typical amount of spice. This place is always nasty. It's always really nasty here. Bear Jerky, we'll just take all this. I'm not going to use my lays, and I'll tell you why. Well, I'll, I'll use it on a, a tick. Um, the reason being is there's one thing that really worries me about encounter, um, encountering. Oh, are we going to be displaced over there? Yeah, okay. Um, the one thing that really scares me on my way to Grit Gate, or my way out of in this instance, is um, finding... A novice of the sightless way that's the only thing that really spooks me and um, you if you probably know that the best thing you can have against a novice of the sightless way is oh god we are dying okay let's hide here for a moment uh, is a ranged attack, especially one that doesn't miss. I don't know why I'm insisting on fully exploring this zone. These mirthworms really, like, slow roll take it out of you. Okay, that centipede is dead. Ow! God damn. Stop it. God, they're coming from every angle here. This, I don't know why I'm doing this. Mostly, I guess, XP. You know, the thing I'm not a huge fan of when it comes to the long blade, maybe the reason I, I don't I don't use it very often is because oh, okay. Oh god. Okay, we're out of here. I'm probably gonna die. I died. I hate that. Two slug snouts. God, I hate the path to Grit Gate so much, actually. <laughs> We were so close to getting out. And now I have to do all of that again. That was such a slog. Probably gonna die again right here. I'm not sure why this is like immediately so spicy. Actually, I do. It's because it's the path to Grit Gate. <laughs> God, I hate this place. I don't know how the Barathermites live like this. Yeah, I mean, my main problem with the, um, the long blade is it doesn't really have any, like, long-term fight benefits. Like, it doesn't have a passive that kind of escalates your, um, defenses against whatever you're fighting. I don't know what's fighting, what's shooting at me over there, but it looks like a machine gun. I know they're... Okay, so there's slugs being whizzed out. God. 
like how many slug snouts are there between me and the surface all right we're gonna try again i'm gonna try again at least uh we've killed a few things yeah like um sorry just to like put a cap on my thoughts on long blade like you know axes provide cleaving so at least over the long course of a, of a combat you are like slowly getting through their armor you're you're shaving off how does this happen i really have to turn off like this is the most annoying thing about mirthworms is that they're trivial but they're not they're not trivial um okay so apparently they're easy i'll leave it on for now but like this is how i end up in like a really nasty situation like this because they're they're just gonna bust through my armor especially in that formation okay i'm gonna go back into grit gate we're just gonna like lead them over here and then fight them off i don't have lays anymore do i Yeah, like the Mirthworms, um, they, they shave away your armor, much the same like an axe, and it, it really is brutal. They're, they're not to be underestimated. You're famished, okay. I didn't mean to collect blood, but okay, we have blood now. So wait a minute. I don't ha I bet you I don't have tinkering now, do I? Oh god. Okay, let's uh customs and folklore and disassemble. And um I'm saving up for trash divining. Okay, I'm not going to spend as much time going through that like area because I just I just did all that and then I died. So now we don't have um lays i'm pretty sure that it will be like guaranteed a, a guaranteed roll god this is so miserable right now it's like i don't have the armor um my uh, my armor keeps getting cleaved by mirthworms it's just it's just a mess Oh, I didn't take a uh, improved dueling stance, did I? Long blade. Okay, there. We need to take improved dueling stance because it is genuinely better. Yeah, like I think that long blades. Are, oh, stop cracking my boar gloves, for God's sakes! This is, it just makes everything slightly more frustrating. Um. Yeah, long blades are just meant to be like really a really good weapon and not necessarily like. A long haul weapon. I, I don't know. I just like the fact that I can stun lock with cudgels and I like that I can break through the armor with axes. I don't know um, what long blade offers um, in that kind of same category. I guess you could argue that um, being able to disarm an enemy definitely cuts through a lot of the difficulty of a combat. Okay, that is... Okay, there were now there's there there there's the grenades, a slug. Okay, so we're getting slug snouted right now. Ouch! Right, he's got a carbide longsword. So we want to swipe that out of his hand. I don't think that I did it. Um I died. This is miserable. This is absolutely miserable. I, I started this episode thinking I had gotten a, a cool uh, clothing piece that gave me rep with ro robots. And instead, I have the most miserable path from Gritgate possible, I think. Outside of having like 50 chain turrets and like a bazillion slumberlings, um, this is like 
just as miserable and now i'm just playing badly because i'm impatient because i've done this like three times and this is why i didn't want to teleport straight to grid gate is because now we have to do this and i don't have another recoiler out of here i should stop auto exploring it's really not doing me any favors okay so this is what we're gonna do we're gonna do this the slow methodical way as opposed to the quick and uh, painful way. Is I'm, I'm going to stop auto exploring for one thing. Um, I'm going to, uh, I, I guess I just said I was going to stop auto exploring. I'm just going to fight a bunch of stuff. And then as soon as I'm like content with how much I've fought. I'm going to go uh, back to grid gate and set a checkpoint. And um, I'm also going to whenever they cleave my boar gloves i'm going to wait 500 turns or however many i need to so we're going to come back here i'm going to do set wait and i uh, officially actually don't like that let me let me let me look at my key binds uh key mapping i i would prefer to have the weight that i am used to i like i like the weight that i'm used to um delete key bind yes Wait number of turns, shift W. And um, wait, I also want to like, is it rest until, until morning? Yeah, it is uh, control tilde. There we go. I like, I like all of that. Um, shift W, we're gonna wait 500 turns. Seems like it's only 300 turns because uh, I got my AV6 back. Is anything else cracked right now? Nope. You know what? We're even going to take a, 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 a nice a dram of water and clean ourselves off. Because who, who wants to be looking slimy, you know? No, we don't have a... Oh, okay, I'm going to stop being upset about this road from Great Great. I know I said I wasn't going to auto-explore anymore, but I know pretty much what to expect in this area. There's nothing too bad in specifically this area. Alright. Now, I don't, I don't like this. Also, yeah, we have to buy stuff again. Oh my god, dueling stance? Uh... <laughs> Customs and folklore and tinkering and disassembling. All right. Third time's a charm, you know? Okay, the way droid is helping immensely and killed the electrofuge. Thank you so much for that. So there is a slug snout over there um, being a jerk. This, um, this robot here is really fixing to die. Infiltrator. Infiltrator. I got 325 XP from that. I'm really sick and tired of the slime, I won't lie. I just, like, every time I move, it's like, nope, you didn't go there, actually. Do we still have slugs now over here trying to kill us? Doesn't seem like it. I think the way droids are really doing the Lord's work in this episode. Nice. Good. There's another slug snout. We're gonna grab this. Treat these as scrap. Disassemble. This, this is not wise play in front of a slug snout. What? Did the electrofuge like hit the wall or something? How did I take damage there? Okay, the slug snout has take, uh, taken the ultimate, paid the ultimate price. I, I truly hate slug snouts right now.
I know that's a controversial opinion. It's not. No one likes slug snouts. Every time I press the auto explore button, I find myself in a position I would prefer not to be in. Someone out there is like, well, why do you keep pressing it then? Well, I don't know. I'm a flawed person, okay? Okay, here's that jerk. Maybe we can... Yeah, we disarmed him. I want an animation for disarming someone. That would make me use long, long blades. Can you imagine if there was a cool animation... Or like when you disarm it and you see the just like the little tile of the blade flies out of their hand onto the spot where it ends up that would be so cool with it of course with a cool little sound effect like a queen you know like a little swing and that would just that would just make my day that would a hundred percent make it worth it thermal grenade defoliant grenade freeze grenade wow I guess um, we managed to get to the Pewis Templar before they threw all their grenades. And so we, we got all their cool grenades. Oh god. It's like I take a single step and it a nightmare. Okay, we want to get over here and rest. Cool. Every, just like take two steps rest take two steps rest. Oh, you know what? I'm actually pretty content with um, How much progress we've we've made here. So let's go ahead and make a checkpoint <laughs> I was really not expecting This entire episode to be me trying to dig my way out of great gate, but it really does seem to be that way. I would, generally speaking, have ended the episode already. But, um... Stop that. Why Why won't you... Why do you refuse to disassemble that cracked lens? Okay, we got a glow sphere. I'll take... I'll take everything. Oh, I guess I can't. Do I have a shield on right now? I do. I should uh, equip that iron buckler. It is genuinely better. Smacko. Rest. We're good. Um, kill. Kill. No. Oh, God. Stop pressing the auto explore button. Me? Good Lord. It's just like every time I'm like, okay, we're good. There's like, there's nothing else, right? I press it. Nope, not good. Actually, there's like a, a mountain of uh, mirthworms still. And, uh, you know, 16 slug snouts. And they're all around you somehow. Okay, um, we're just setting a checkpoint. If I could get a level up and get my uh light manipulation i'd really appreciate it that looks okay that's not our long blade i was wondering why there was a long blade on the floor we could um wait first of all we could we could let, let's throw a glow sphere in our hand secondly let's put a steel long sword in our other arm there we go and let's get out of there wow i really made that painful for myself rest we're good i keep trying to go down because that's how i expect to explore dungeons is going down but in fact i'm going up which is a kind of novel shield slam okay we 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 want to get out of here rest go up way droids are continuing to do the lord's work God, there's so much slime, and it's such a problem. <laughs> Way droid is fighting the hermit. Sucks for the hermit. Not, not really bothered about it. 
Oh, slender. Uh, yeah, I mean, can't wear any of that. The worst thing about getting a, uh, like a shirt that, that is a disguise for a turret, which is possibly one of the most valuable shirts I think I've ever seen ever, um, is it's not even worth anything. <laughs> like it's, it's actually worthless because no one else values that in the same way that I do. No, uh, Dromad does anyway. Okay. What is this? Shade oil injector. Nice. Uh, get out of here. Tick. We've got a... Um, oh, thank God. We leveled up. Um, do I actually want light manipulation? It didn't really help me as much as I'd hoped. Let's take sleep gas generation. I, I know. Listen, I, my logic was sound when it came to um the light manipulation but i actually think that sleep gas would be better in some ways uh right up we want this to be where mark target is and i also want dueling stand okay we're good there actually that's fine and so yeah the idea now how did that happen? What did I press? How did I end up north? I wonder if it, there is a lot of slime and it's not just like my character being very clumsy. So yeah, the idea now is that we don't actually need... Uh... <laughs> Yo, Cut is being a real jerk right now. just an absolute asshole the moment i pass up my light manipulation they throw a novice of the sightless way in exactly the worst position ever okay we managed to break sight with them thank god but oh my god that is that is some absolute inexcusable behavior there Oh man, that is like the most this game has ever pissed me off. <laughs> that was like the most sleight of hand bullshit Cud has ever tried to pull on me. Oh, you passed up light manipulation, huh? Well, we never threw a novice of the sightless way before, but now I'm thinking now is the, is the moment. It's just like... That's the the biggest jerk move ever. That is some like waiting in the shadows ready to, to, to kick you while you're down and bleeding. Um, not really cool with this situation, I'll be honest. Are we not sprinting? Oh, right. Okay, we're just gonna run away. Don't really want to deal. Cool. I'm pretty sure that's the crab dying. I guess I could have tried my sleep gas. I really uh, ought to make use of that. Do we have any more genomes? We have one more genome to look forward to. All right. Um, let's leave. My God, I can't believe we made it out of there. That was miserable. Oh, please don't. Please don't now die in the, in the flower fields. Uh, I think that's a fire snout. That doesn't look like a... That looks a bit too red. Look at that. I'm actually right about that. That's fine. Fire snouts are really not a problem. I say that after taking like half my health. And damage from that. Uh, that that I, I was hoping that Chromling was like um, a sign that there was going to be a, a legendary Barathermite or a Mechanimus, but nope. Um, I don't think that def uh, defensive stance is really going to do us any good. I was thinking maybe we could sw swap to something else, but I really still think that dueling stance is our best shot right now. It's plus three to hit 
and we can um, attempt to disarm. I can't believe they managed to hobble me when I knocked them prone. I heard I heard some kind of shot to our east. Okay, swipe. I guess I should reserve swipe for someone like this who's um uh you know what let's do let's release some sleep gas. There we go. Heck yeah, that worked exactly as intended. I know you can you can really make sleep gas amazing. I know sleep gas is like absolutely incredible stuff. Uh, a little bit worried about that. I think that's just a sap. I think we're actually friendly with the sap. No, we're not. I don't know why I thought that. We don't have a ranged weapon, so the sap is just going to be a huge, like, massive pain in the butt. So let's just, like, leave. So that's not a two-headed slug snout. I think that's just a two-headed boar. Um, I was really hoping to get the Jopa to end the episode. The sap is 100% just going to, like, drain. Can we... Can we knock them prone? Yeah. What was that? The juice sap explodes. Right. I That was a new animation and it was a really cool one. That being said. It was also pretty dangerous. So, I mean, the nice thing about sleeping gas is it lasts almost as long um like the the gas kind of like takes long enough to dissipate that we can kind of hide amongst it um the ai and cud for enemies are um i won't say they're dumb they're smart enough to know not to go in the gas but not smart enough to know when they're at a disadvantage like they they won't go in the gas and so therefore you can just kind of like regenerate your health like you can just hide out in the gas and it's not a big deal um and yeah the gas takes long enough to dissipate that you can actually wait for the cooldown to come off for gas and just keep it going forever that is a chain turret good lord good thing uh I'm, I, I play fast but not that fast that is i'm pretty sure it slugs now yep Really, I really just don't want to deal. Are we still lost? We are still lost. We don't have Harvest 3. So, unfortunately, um, I can't get that Witchwood uh, Bark. Oh, that is legendary. Let's hope they don't die to the Slugs now. Let's hope they kill the Slugs now and are weak enough that I can get their reputation. But they are loved by robots. Um, I'm gonna make a note of this in my journal. Loved by robots. Uh, okay, they did manage to kill the slug snout. Let's let's leave this zone and freeze it. Um, really would prefer to keep that. Loved by robot. What is that new laser beam? Oh God, the animation is so cool, but also I'm dying. <laughs> I really wish things would stop exploding near me. It would really help, you know, make me, make me feel better. So that was a feral law. They're undoubtedly throwing some tumbling paws at me. I'm, I'm fleeing from this zone. This is a fungal forest. Uh, engraved pitcher, uh, clay pitcher. That's kind of nice. 
Did we already know of that, uh, that part of the, that, um, Sultan? Okay, um, I'm actually feeling a little bit better. I'm feeling a little bit more optimistic. I mean, uh, you know, it's a salt hopper. That's fine. The thing about the salt hoppers, I think we can potentially actually get their weapon from them. And they are... No, we didn't this time. They, it's, a, it's a long blade. That is a lot of tumbling pods. Le that is another legendary robot. And they are also loved by Naftali tribe and robots. Hated by antelopes, disliked by grazing hedonists, hated by the cursed ghost sect. What is this, um, what is this cursed ghost sect and how, how loved by them am I or, or hated? Uh... Cursed ghost sect, we are at negative 500. Dislikes you, but docile members won't attack you. You aren't welcome in their holy place. Interested in trading secrets about the Sultan they worship. They're also interested in hearing gossip that's about them. Well, okay, I don't know if... Um, making friends with this guy would be a great idea. But I am going to run away from him all the same. Didn't mean to press that, I wanted to sprint. We have a horned chameleon and we're back to tumbling pods over here. Good lord, can we stop being lost, please? Like, can I can I catch a break for a moment? I would really appreciate that. We are famished. We really uh, I can I can kill that horned chameleon. I'm not bothered by that. Okay, let's let's make camp. You know what? Um can't make camp hostiles. Okay, there we go. I'm going to call the episode here because it's getting a little bit long and nothing is getting better. <laughs> nothing is getting better. Uh, I hope you're enjoying the series. If you are, definitely hit the like button and consider subscribing for more content like this. I'll see you guys next time. Take it easy.